Hello guys, good morning. Welcome to Cebu. And it's September 12, 2022. And it's a sunny day. <laughs> and bora. We just celebrated our birthday for Regan Fun. We're happy to, you know, reach a milestone in life. Pero, I don't know, it's like major celebration because we have family at the hospital na mag-urog yun nigawas kahapon yun nigawas so <laughs> oh, traffic like a mic because it's morning rush hour here at the Cebu South Road properties pero mara <laughs> um, dagag pa doon pa sa syudad pa doon pa mo trabaho So how are you guys? How was the weekend? Lami ba? And I think nakan kini nita bu over the weekend. Um, you know, when it comes to sports, um, si Alex Ayala won. Um, you know, the girls U.S. Open um, title uh, for tennis. So it's a big achievement for you know for Pinoy's because because mo na. One ba? Um, Kaya tennis good, di ba? It's like we had really good tennis players, pero wag kita kabot o mito mga world class na kada bang niabot yun sa ATP tour kada bang mga niabot lang may bisag na mo yung top 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 thirty in the world wapa <laughs> pero kani potentials Alex Ayala at you know at seventeen I think so. Kuha na, na champion finally Naka champion yun na naka, Nakakuhaan ta sa girls US Open, girls na not women's Girls, kanang juniors Pero still, that's a big achievement Being, you know Daghan kayo Daghan kayo mga world beaters now Or even Grand Slam champions kanang, Even Iga Swatek Who was a former, you know, junior Grand Slam winner I think she won Wimbledon in 2018 Kanang silang Ons Jube Jobev Oh, so po ansa na sila. So, nanay, uh, appeal sa line up na Pinay si Alex, uh, Alex Ayala para appeal na siya sa ba. Naka-achieve ana na kuan Grand Slam title, di ba? Imagine. So, that's the potential, you know, kung padayo ni siya, baring kuan, may lang yung pag-rise sa career, may yung training, padayo na ang suporta. She has a potential really to, you know, to be, go on, makita na to, to be featured in Grand Slam tournaments. Or what are you talking about? Women's Grand Slam champion, di ba? So, that's a, go on. Um, big things can happen, of course. I mean, grabe ka ng tennis, ano eh, naku, may nagkwarta sa, di ba? <laughs> Kung para ni mo sa, ba? Basketball. <laughs> I mean, that's a potential, but to earn, yes. Especially sa women's ba, okay? sa Pilipinas, women's what? Okay, opportunity professional sports for women there is Pilipinas. Um, maybe there's volleyball, but pilara na ang swildo uh, sa volleyball ano, sa Philippines. At least sa basketball, uh, we have our. PBA na ay kahit pa paano and now the Filipinos have opportunities to play in Japan in Korea in Taiwan naghan na kayong mga liga sa atong Asian neighbors na mamuha o Pilipino para mo duwa so so maa na ikuha na to maa na ikuha na to na swerte isa na when it comes to ka na then then maa lang eh sa kay Guana ni and kang Alex Ayala if she continues to pursue this sport well ako kay ni Guan we're hoping uh, mo na 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 tayo cheer on kung let's say someday mo na na at agwambled dun yun na dito sa Alex Ayala diba o bisagsag sa TV na lang 
Ah, so that's for one. Manay unang kuan. And karon nagdua pa si Alcaraz kontra ni Rude. And Rude is from the Rafael Akal. Ani nga okay is Rude kay Ug si Alcaraz, si Alcaraz is like Spaniard na minus like next Nadal na ni siya. Well, Rude is like the number 5 seed pero mahimo na na either number 1 or 2 depending on the results of the game right now. Alam mo sa sports set. Uh, if one can say my number one sa kalibutan but Rude studied at Rafael Nadal Academy yeah, can say kaya mo can say nag-study sa Rafael Nadal Academy kaya pa lang that's that's Alex Ayala as well so dito nag-study so kuya ko yung mga mga rag mga kuan ba gitrain ni Rafael Nadal um, even from other countries they're making their mark also so I think kung if we really want to have, you know, the next generation of sports stars or you know, world beaters, I think any of government not only have grassroots tournaments, but if they recognize talent, you know, to talent, for example, for tennis, for say, basketball, whatever sport, football, they should, I think, dapat expose yun patuon abroad ng mga bata. Money best program, I think. We can't just rely on the retrain. Go on, ba? The retrain against the gig politics. Oh, di ba? Pero, we train us abroad because not not because of politics, na because they get the best training there, the best coaches, the best, you know, techniques, be exposed to competition as well. Oh, di ba? For example, basketball, na anad na kadres yung liga na, wah, na, imo na katao ani mga pinoy, pero. Ato sa Amerika eh, basing Masyak na lang ka, di ba? Mga, uh, mga high school pa lang Nangkandang ka na ka ha? High school lang mo lang Kamang-kamang na ka sa kuan, di ba? O, di ba? So, muna ba? <laughs> they have to be exposed We have to be exposed <clears throat> Muna ng I commend the uh, You know, the The parents of Alex Ayala Okay Bata ba lang, ilan lang ipa na dito Dito sa Rafael Nadal Academy Di ba? Medyo mauna, maka-afford man sila Medyo, I think they have Sponsors also, but they also have They're well off family But, but mauna ba? Uh, if we really see talent I hope um, uh, Commissioner Noli Iala Mga Philippine Sports Commission Even the President as a matter of policy Hindi mo tag marag Quote-unquote scholarship for for kids lahir lagi ng international exposure especially at a young age although na risk of course expose ni mo yan o wadag confidence or on some if the person is really kuan ba nangyugyo kang nagi talent manang important ding talent identification kayo say basing palakasan sa kaya ang anak ni kuan na may itong ipada dito o diba anak sa kuan anak sa politiko or anak sa in si lakas dia anak di coach oh that's a different story pero nawa pero kung kuan lang yun nalaw na to na yung mga kuan dia and we found we identified real talented kids oh, let's say pro palaro or whatever diba nata yung kuan ba system ba na doon pa manag manila una nang compete then nalaw na to kinsa yung maayo hasa kana ba yung kuan yun kayo sifted properly oh diba then Kuan, kaysa naman mo, di ba, mahal mo sa'yo magpadatag We have, we will bring in Although nice and mag-bring in the foreign coach Pero, di ba, di naman na kuan oh. It's not just about coaching Sometimes it's all about competition also Mahasa ka You keep on competing with the best Di ba Malang lahi kayong player Gigan sa Europe Parang Pilipinas, maayo kay siya Pero yung Europe, banga kay siya that only mo Pilipinas or na ni mo Southeast Asian level o oh, maayo kay sila so manang hindi natin oh, for example bitaw ka ng mga bata nagdako sa states nag high school sa states kaduwa oh. oh, on sa Pilipinas ah, feeling naka I feeler na kayo pero to states kung ano sad kayo sila they're just you know mga 2 star sila oh, di ba? 3 star pero dire, 5 star na sa Pilipinas 5 star recruit na na 
diba? Kung natin yung 3 star tingali mga anak uh, Superstar na Dres Pilipinas So mana ba? Mana we have to kuhan It would be nice kuhan And of course dahil napailangin mga nito with sports karun Of course nag kuhan F1 no Verstappen I think Kuhan madaog na ng Red Bull eh but also one American football, you know, first weekend run first Sunday, first Sunday opening one ba, season openers. So taka na ko ba dua? Sa America grabi na, grabi kaya mga taka hundred thousand ni mananaw. Ano ba? Silang football stadiums ba? Even their college football, manasad. Ayun, sige pa, ongoing sad Pero daghan sad din ka ayaw mananaw, di ba? Nang tag 100,000, more than 50,000, 60,000 Amazing kayo yung kuhan ito Hindi na mag-mask, mag-inom nag-beer, mag-sigit-sagit na Pero yeah, sa Philippines So, mga full eh Ay kuhan, yun na ito yung mga Pag-orom sa tanagkuman, PDA But sa Cebu Kuhan pa kayo I don't know Hopefully Mabalik na yung si Safi I think they have their Pre-season tournaments na Kuhan lang Yeah Although malay na Spectator sports The reason sa ito Hindi magkain Naghan mananaw Pero now say mananaw I think mga championships Pero hopefully Kuhan ba We support them also Although malay na yung sign They're just like An entertainment na lang ba Pero for many kids, it's a pathway also to a better life. Manang supportahan ito mga sports ba? Kasi mo na yung scholarships or they being honored to the country. Wala kayo si Dylan Diaz, di ba? Kasi si Dylan, no? Nalawa si Dylan. He keep on competing sa abroad sa morning. Swerte sa siya. And she really has talent. Pero kasi si EJ Obuena, o. Nalawa na itong pool vaulters, number three in the world. Was having a hot streak in the past few weeks. He's got the Ogug Mamids. He, he, but can he get gold, silver, bronze? But maybe a podium finish. He's competing in Europe. Yeah, na ba? Kaya kung la, la ng ubang national athletes sa Pilipinas, lakang tag mga maayo tingali. Pero di li isla kakuan kay na aras sila sa Pilipinas. Why competition ba? You don't see what's Kinsa, for example, si EJ, he's competing with the best all every week. Pero pag naay mga world class, world beater na ang world number one as do plantis. Na na ang kwan ba na yung kontra sa Olympics actually. Pero pag na you can measure up your progress, you know techniques, maybe nga na ba. So manay ko na to na hopefully yes we we will send more athletes abroad. Mabisag din lang yan yung grassroots Ang grassroots yung i-train na daan Like what Iala did Pero ang dag ko They should Kung naagit ay Pang potential ba Pang Asian Games Or even Bisag si Sea Games lang Tapos na asla yung Constant tournament Uy na asla yung They have to be exposed To You know Higher competitions Yes kung di 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 sila di di sila di will stagnate or they'll just be shocked at the level of competition kaya namang lahi ng experience mga veterano na kailang kontra na ano yung mga moves na naikuan na you can only learn by you know by constantly competing so mga naikuan na ito I don't remember on the Spanish Boulevard and I think you've seen this road Many, 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 many times. Mana, mana yang traffic karon? So mana di sa Cebu dia? Ada tu mungkin sport stars na nangule si June Mar Fajardo last weekend. Na am kaya pun sa Cebu nag launch si yang Kraken Apparel and also Dina Wong. Um, our that's our volleyball star or a professional volleyball player. One of the most popular in the country Taga Minglanilian is Inday Dina Played for USJR Ateneo de Cebu And also of course Ateneo de Manila University And now playing pro at Chocomucho So mahal na na Si Dina ni uli 
meet and greet the Katsugishig fans and it's for the benefit of her dad I think may sakit yung dad so wala kudos to the fans congratulations thank you so much for all your support also katusaw mga namalit sa t-shirt ni Junmar actually ako palit ako yung t-shirt at that time pero mag white park ito yung ako was bringing a car pero sige lang sunod na lang kay fans kay Wayne akong father in law ni ni Junmar sige ano yung itong kuhaan ron laban lang so anyway mana na 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 tas Fuente Osmenia like to thank you for accompanying me this morning and I hope you have a great week ahead happy na sa October guys namandam na to sa Pasko but yeah tell me who are your favorite you know sports teams sports personalities sa man yun yung tanaw sa yun yung mga predictions Let me know kung sa inyong Kuhan ba? Yung sa inyong idol ka ron Hapit na sa ng NBA season And lingaw pa kayong Eurobasket ron I think silang Uy na out na silang Jokic Pero silang Luka I think na pa Ang France na pa Ang Finland I think na pa So exciting sa nang iladiha And Pohon next year will be the FIBA World Cup a basketball to be held here in Manila in the Philippines and Japan and Indonesia but Pilipinas get ang kwan so hopefully mga na magkita kita 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 ta huwag mag enjoy enjoy ta sa itong sports sports and wala pala yun lang pala yun lang sa support ta and thank you so much for watching bye bye bye